there are different stages from the beginning till the gestation completes so every living being in the nature have their own gestation period gestates in a different period of time might be it is different from mammals even from one to the other we are all mammals right we are all social living animals yes. humans but still other mammals like if you see some sort of herbivores like cattle they have their own gestation and camels they have their own gestation elephants they have their own gestation tigers lions what not every type of animal who lives direct birth to the young one may have a different type of gestation period the same way human beings also having certain gestation period do you know what type of gestation period it is how much yes. time it is yes 9 months 9 months so the 0 to 9 months will be very very crucial period for a woman to give birth for an young one this resembles as a typical human so we are all human beings we have all similar characters but not the features we all have two limbs like two hands we have two legs we have one face we have two eyes we have all a similar type of developments can be seen during the developmental stages in the womb of a mother but not the same thing that is wonderful thing we have to understand right it is different from one to the another we are will we will not match each other even though we are in millions right we have our unique characters which were given by our parents right so now apart from all those things now today we are going to discuss about the fetal development from the beginning so you people are coming from non science background students also can easily understand and easily to understand what the actual concept beyond that i just prepared a ppt where you will be seeing nice images as well as the developmental stages how it will be inside the uh, womb of a mother you will be seeing it today okay are you ready yes, yes ma'am ma are you ready yes, yes ma'am ma okay fine pay attention so the period of the zygote is very much important that is the conception period is just 10 to 14 days to fertilize the egg then the egg will be implanted in the mother's uterus you know the zygote in the first stage that will be just like a pin size okay so the first month if you see the first month the timeline of prenatal development this is the timeline of prenatal development so the day one is the conception when that when it takes place generally the fertilization implanting process into the mother's uterus will take 7 to 14 days of time okay so after 18th day the heart begins to beat 21 days it start pumping the blood through separate closed circulatory system now you are understanding which system will first function in the fetus heart circulatory system that consists in of heart okay so 28th day then it will start with the respiratory system which will function eye ear and respiratory system will begin to form
okay then this is placenta which is very important so these will be protecting membranes so if you see the embryo in two months it is just just one by four inch long and has distinct slightly finger development fingers development can be seen the veins are clearly visible in the heart the heart has divided into right and left chambers bones begin to form development of internal organs will begin in the second month okay the embryo is attached to the mother by umbilical cord okay so you can see here the embryo how it is the amniotic fluid it is always in the movement moving condition you can see this is the mother if you see the umbilical cord which is attached to here okay this is the vaginal portion and this is the cervix is 
particular part near the reproductive organs that that is vestigial after the development. During the development, all parts along with that one needs also will develop. Okay. Ma'am, uh, in the fourth to fifth month, in the early term, the gender of the babies. 